Alrighty, what is going on everybody? My name is Blitzwinger, and of course, welcome back to LEGO Batman. My goodness, have I uh, missed saying that? I honestly did. <laughs> it's been about, uh, I think, 10 days since we finished the last mission of LEGO Batman, and of course, as I promised, there's gonna be two, for sure, at least two more episodes, maybe three, uh, depending on whether or not I decide to do some uh, character showcases and things like that. But without further ado, let's get into today's episode. Uh, which is gonna actually carry us to the opposite side of the Batcave. We haven't gone to this side very often. And as you can see, it's pretty cool that um, uh, we've got all the different mini kits here, which is, that's kind of gonna be what the third video is gonna be about. Showcasing all the mini kits and all the characters, etc. Uh, just kind of showcasing the 100% uh, completion rate for LEGO Batman. So that'll be the idea. Just gonna give you a little bit of a quick tour around the room here. Looking pretty gosh darn cool indeed. We've got the Wayne Manor, which is actually something we're going to be visiting in just a split moment. So let's go ahead and do that, shall we? So today we're going to be taking on one of the two bonus levels. Sorry about this, just a sec, guys. Alrighty, so of course, just as soon as I start recording, uh, the fire trucks and police trucks and everything decides to pass by my house. Fantastic. <laughs> but nonetheless, of course, today we're going to be taking on one of the two exclusive levels available once you complete all the mini kits so first off we're gonna do the wayne manor level and then there's still one more to go which should be pretty gosh darn cool so without further ado let's get a rolling shall we and uh, let's see what mr alfred has to say here shall we in the lego universe anything is possible bruce wayne appears to have left one million studs holy moly that's awesome lying around wayne manor well, that's not too smart, Bruce. Who just leaves one million studs lying around the place? I mean, it's... Then again, if you're a billionaire, one million dollars is not that much for you now, is it? Alrighty, so... Uh, laying around Wayne Manor, collect them as fast as possible. So, of course, this is kind of an arcade challenge, actually, because... Uh, the real challenge really is about, um... Basically getting a million studs in the quickest manner possible, so, uh... Get it? Manor? Because, wait, manor? No, that wasn't funny, was it? Okay, but let's go ahead and assemble this, and as you can see, we need to earn 1 million studs, but no multipliers and no anything that can basically assist you uh, with that. So you have to collect, basically in this challenge, there are only purple studs, from what I remember, and those purple studs will each give you 10,000, of course, coins. Now, if you do your math correctly, that means we need to collect 100, yes, you heard me collect correctly, 100 purple studs in this mission in order to complete it so uh, it's gonna be definitely no walk in the park it's gonna be a ride in the park on this thing alrighty so of course we kick things off with again gardener batman which is something that is always weird in the lego games that batman really o always is a gardener in these games for some odd reason okay so you're just gonna go ahead and use that uh, that particular vehicle right there i'm not sure what you want to call that a type of tractor i guess uh, to mow down those rocks and once you've done so it will allow some flowers to sprout through then we're gonna take this uh, Basically, uh, I guess it's a grass cutter or something along those lines Which again, why the heck grow all this stuff just in order to cut it all down? <laughs> I'm not sure if Batman understands the point of uh, gardening, but hey, he's Batman. I shouldn't be arguing with him He knows best or at least I think he knows best All right, so we're gonna just chop all this down Doing our best. I love how there's just a giant explosion and when you hit these things, there's like an explosion as if it's dynamite. I mean, for God's sakes, it's just flowers. <laughs> okay, so let's take these suckers down. Vacuum them up, vacuum them up like a boss, like a south boss. Alrighty, and there's our first purple stud. So that's a lot of work for just one stud. Don't worry, it's not going to be this difficult to get all the rest. So don't concern yourself with that. I just wanted to check if I needed to smash those or not. I forgot. Alrighty, so let's go ahead and grab that. There we go. So we're well on our way. 99 more to go. <laughs> okay, so next up, what we're going to do is we're going to work our way over to here where there are a bunch of trash cans next to Wayne Manor. I don't know. I guess this is their trash area and they separate stuff out probably, right? Like you have some recyclables here, etc, etc, etc. And we're going to assemble this uh, operational computer right here. So we're going to assemble this little power panel using Robin and then a nice handy chair, of course. Now, in order to access the computer, we need to activate it first with Robin. So once you've done so, then you can go ahead and hop onto the computer chair and... What the? Okay, I was supposed to get magnetized into the universe. What is happening here? There we go. Okay, that works. That was odd. 
I don't know. I, I made a very special sound effect and nothing happened. That was embarrassing. Alrighty, so let's start smashing and bashing, shall we? Now, uh, what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna switch one of the characters to uh, Batman with the explosive suit. Sorry, just a sec. I'm sorry about that, guys, but again, I I've tried to start recording this episode three times, and every time there's other fire trucks or something going by, so I apologize. I'm gonna try to cut it all out so you guys never actually hear any of it, so uh, I hope you guys can forgive me for that one. Alrighty, so let's go ahead and set a bomb down over here. Then switch to Poison Ivy to make these jumps a heck of a lot easier to deal with. Now, I need someone who can glide. So, gliding suit Batman was supposed to do that, but uh, that obviously did not work out very well. So, let's get ourselves another double jumper. There we go. Okay, so now switch back to Batman. I'm gonna set down the bomb. Whoops, it is it. And boom shakalaka, it goes kablamo. And now, of course, once again, we need to get another character to hop on over there. And recover. And uh, get that purple stud. So as you can see, we are already at 70,000. Not too shabby at all. Okay, so... Uh, whoops, it is it. Wait. Let me go over here first. And then, from here, actually... Jump up and switch back to Batso. Time to set him down a moment. All right, time to go boom boom. All right, that was awesome. That's a lot of points right there. There we go. We're at over 100,000 finally. That took long, but we actually accomplished it, which is fantastic. Okay. Oh, yeah, I forgot these fall down. Oh, careful about that. Those fall down, obviously, so be very, very gentle with those. Okay, gonna knock this down. And then we need to figure out how to get our way up there. There we go. That works. And now again, gonna need an explosive. Boom, shakalaka. Very nice. Oi, what the? Why didn't I just continue to ride along with the actual thingy, my dude? Thingy, my dude. That's words. Not really. Okay, there we go. Grab that as well. Gonna come on down. Now we need Batso again. Or Batgirl, depending on who you picked for this particular challenge. Just a character that can smash the glass, that's basically it. Okay... Whoa, what the... What the heck, Batman? I mean, come on! Nope, not good. Still not good. Batman! Batman! Walk with me! There we go. Hey! Okay. Okay, grab that. Sorry for the awkward silence there. I was just uh, trying to figure out a way to actually get these pesky studs over here. Okay, so there we go. We recovered everything we needed there. Now, from what I remember, you need about 480,000 studs before moving on to the third and final area that has uh, studs to offer. So there's still quite a bit more to go, obviously, uh, if you can count. Okay. Um, I thought this top one was supposed to blow up as well. Maybe I'm incorrect about that. Huh, okay. I guess I wasn't correct about that. Let's go ahead and push that up. I think this can blow up, though. Nope, okay. I guess I'm incorrect about all that as well. I'm gonna recover some extra studs right there. Careful, no, don't fall off. Okay, boom. Send that to go boom, boom. Hoppity hoppity hop. Hey, careful. I don't remember if those blow up, so let's test them just in case. Nope, they don't. Okay, terrific. Okay. Come on. No! <laughs> oh, failed attempt at jumping. Okay, this is confusing. Stop. Why did you have to become Poison Ivy as well? It makes it very difficult to understand where I am. Okay, so, uh, let's get to Penguin. Set that off. And then we need someone who can walk on the green guck. Once you've done so, switch to Robin or Nightwing with the magnet boots. Okay, so this one activates. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Uh, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Before this disappears. There we go. Okay, terrific. Gonna grab this. Now... 
Right here is one that is very, very easy to miss because there are three uh, things that, uh, three studs that are given to you right over here. So that's really, really important. Try to grab that, of course. Okay, what the heck? Why is that bomb down there? Oh, I guess because the first one went off and the other ones didn't. Okay, that's pretty cool. Alright, let's come on down over here. And then down here, we need to blow up as well. Boom shakalaka, very nice. Okay, that's another one for us. God, Robin, why did you have to come with me? Goodness gracious, I mean, come on. Robinho, you didn't have to come with me, my man. Could have just walked away or done something else. That would have kept you busier. Ah, yay, yay. Okay, missed that one stud, which kind of sucks. Ah, whoa, careful. Don't want to be falling off at this point. At this point, there's no return. This is the point of no return, my friends. Okay, come on. There you go. Nicely done. And hop on over over here. Set that off to go boom, boom. And finally, of course, blast that. We have one more to go, which is actually past this point. So make sure to hop on over, not fall into this thing. And there you go. You've got 480,000 studs, which is exactly what you should have. Uh, going into the next area. So you're going to grab another one right here. Hop on down. Well, or at least attempt to hop on down. Come on. I don't remember. Was there anything in the corners here? Was there? Tell me. Tell me, please. I think there wasn't, actually. All right. So let's hop into the next computer, shall we? So this is the second computer system, which, by the way, I don't know why Batman has all these complex things going all around uh, but in here you have to do basically kind of reminds me of um, uh, it's not marble slab what was the name marble slab what am I talking about an ice cream shop um, I don't remember the name of that uh, game the one where you roll a, a ball banana blitz monkey ball I believe it's called monkey ball I don't know why the maps remind me of monkey ball so uh, basically what you have to do is you have to drag using this little uh, machinery you have to drag this uh, metal steel ball, or at least it looks metal-ish. Uh, it's obviously made out of Lego. Uh, but you basically have to drag it and knock down all of these little uh, orange uh, propellers. And each propeller that explodes will reward you with, of course, a purple stud, as you might have noticed. So it's definitely a very much a, a time-consuming process. Don't touch that lever, by the way, because the first time I did that, I realized that, hey, that's just going to send you back into the real world. So don't touch that yet. Just uh, focus on uh, pushing the ball. Now, by the way, uh, the, the one thing that a lot of people don't know is that you can actually push it just with your character, too. So, like, if you want, as you can see, you could actually just use the characters to push the ball. You don't have to drag it by the string, which actually, in certain situations, is a little bit easier to control the ball with the characters instead of, the, um, instead of this particular machinery. However, if, let's say, you're in a situation like right here, where we need to drag the ball up a little uh, pathway, it's obviously a lot easier to use the little machinery thingamadoo. Uh, to do so. Okay, so we're gonna hop on up here. For example, for this one, I remember I think it was easier to just drag it along. Whoops. Okay, well, might as well just kick it down for now. There we go. So once that sinks, it's gonna just respawn. Whoa! Okay, I failed there. So let's just run it into this these ones right here, I guess. Uh, there we go. That's another one. Come on, spawn back, my friend. That's another one. Gonna take down those two up high. Move, Robin. Robin, you ruined our plan. Like always. Robin just ruined stuff for us. No, come on, <laughs> Robin. Oh my god, Robin, you really do suck. Uh, save the ball, save the ball. <laughs> save the ball. Oh my god, oh my god, I might actually do it. I might actually do it. Oh, no, no, no. No. <laughs> oh, that was too close. Robin was like a sea otter or something. Okay, so uh, as you can see, if you're stuck in the water, um, I think if you get a swimming character, you might actually be able to just get out of the water. Never mind. You just die right away, which I guess technically does get you out of the water, so that works, right? So, um, let's get... Oh, no. Okay, let's go get the machinery. I'm obviously very inaccurate uh, just with the ball, so... Okay, let's get the machine. Machine to the rescue! Go, grab the ball! Alright, move, Robin. 
This is Robin coming through. Robin, move! Okay, so. Let's come up here. And, of course, try to take down these two suckers. Hey! Hey! Hey, grab it! What the heck was that? That ball just fell off on its own reasoning. Oh, that ball did not want to listen to me. How dare it? That sounds very wrong when you think about it. Don't think about it, then. Okay, this is just great. This is just going fantastically well. Okay, there goes the ball again. Oh my goodness, me and those machines, we just cannot get along. Now, by the way, also, if you're in co-op, of course, you could speed this way, 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 way the heck up. Uh, via the process of you being in one of the machines, your friend being in one of the machines. And by the way, uh, the other thing is, if a machinery fell down into the water, that doesn't mean that it's done for. Uh, because all you have to do is you have to find a little platform to come on up on. So, for example, if I go around... I believe that there's one in the corner over here. Um, hmm... Maybe I'm incorrect about that. This is taking far too long. Like, way, way too long. Come on, turn around. Slip on through there. And... There we go. So there's the little platform that you can actually use to come on up. Oh, come on. There we go. So as you can see, I mean, this is definitely a time-consuming process, but at the same time, to me, I like the, the arcade aspect of it, where it definitely feels like a way, way, way different to the actual uh, game modes. Goodness gracious. And then there are issues with the actual ball not listening to you. Come on. Okay, right now, why is it not... There we go. Finally. That took long enough. Okay, so now... I have to guide this damn thing. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. That did not work, now did it? I thought it was gonna work. It wasn't working at all. And it's also nice to have the two characters next to each other, so I don't know where the next, the second Robin is. He's just chilling. He's like, oh, I'm just uh, having fun, you know how I do. Okay, nope, stop, stop. Okay, now I just gotta align the ball a little bit. That's what I'm trying to accomplish right here. If I could actually move the ball, for God's sake. Hey, hey. There we go. Okay, good. So we got rid of that. I don't know what's going on with this car. Is it going in the water or not? Uh, there we go. Okay, perfect. That actually works. So I'm going to try to do a double save here. So if that works, then I'm okay. Perfect. Don't even have to worry about it. Now I just have to recover this ball. Drive it down this way. Onto this crazy pyramid thingamadoo. And there we go. Okay, that's one of the more difficult ones, actually, to get, to be honest. So, uh, be careful with that one. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, that was a fail. Let's try that again, shall we? I feel like I'm driving a giant piece of cucumber or something. Come on. Come on! Get over here! We need two of these to be smashed. Go, thingamadoo! Hey, hey, hey! You see, if the other character was next to me... Then what I, what I could have done was switch to the character and then just push that, uh, the character into the... Use the character to push the ball into the other one, so... That's why I said it's nice to have the two characters next to each other. However, the game in this scenario does not want to work with me. Oh my goodness, really? I mean, come on. Just go up there. Go up there. Go up. Up! Okay. I am getting mad now. I am getting mad! I am gonna turn into the Hulk. Pickle Hulk. Okay. So let's come up here. Grab this thing, I'm gonna do. No, you're going this way now. You're going this way, I said. Take that down. Fantastic. No, 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 no. What are you doing? What are you doing? Did I say to do that? I didn't, did I? I, I don't, I exactly remember not saying to do that. So why the heck did you decide to do so? Ball. Thanks, ball. That was exactly the way that I wanted to hit you. Just go straight, for God's sake. There you go. How difficult is that, really? I mean, really. There we go. Okay, move, Robin. Jesus. It's like the game is trying to make it the most difficult thing ever for me. Instead of working with me, the game is working against me. Hey, that was too quick. That was far too quick. All right, this will be a good one right here. Watch. Well, never mind. <laughs> this will be a good one. I'll just throw it right in the water. Okay. Oh, there we go. That actually worked. At least we got something out of that. 
Okay, thanks, Robin. Appreciate that, bro. I appreciate how you're completely in the way. I just love this. I love that the... I love that the, uh... Second character is so helpful! <laughs> okay. I, I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna... No! No! Okay. This is ridiculous. This is unbelievable! This is the hardest I've ever had to do this. Like, this is incredibly... Ugh. Uncooperative. Oh my goodness, really? Now I'm screwed, aren't I? Okay, where's the swimsuit? So you could drown? Alright, I can't believe I just said that, by the way. Where's the swimsuit so you could drown? Oh my goodness, really? I mean, come on! Every single time! This thing doesn't want to work. Okay, you know what? This is not gonna work without the vehicle, is it? Even though I hate this damn thing, it's like ridiculously silly. And it barely maneuvers. Like, look at the way it turns. Oh, I am a goofy thing I'm gonna do. Oh, come, come, really? I mean, right now. Really? There we go. Thank you. Okay. Thanks for doing that, right? I appreciate that, bro. Hey, 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 hey. Stay, stay. Stay, ball. Stay, crazy ball. At least hit one more. One more, please. At least one more. Yes. Okay, fantastic. Life in plastic, it's fantastic. I don't know why I'm dragging you into the water. It makes no sense. So let's go roundy. Now, we're doing well in terms of uh, getting close to a million. I just realized we're already at 910,000, so pretty close. Oh, God. <laughs> Look at this. I mean, you can't even get up. For God's sake. Oh, goodness gracious. This is ridiculous. Oh, come on. Oh, come on! <laughs> uh, yes, yes, okay. Somehow that actually worked. We got one more to go in this crazy little area, and then we gotta move outwards. Yep, of course the vehicle is gonna go right up the ramp, isn't it? Go, go, go! Yes! Okay, that actually worked. I'm kind of amazed. Okay, don't fall into water all the time. No, no! No, 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 no! Ah. Get up there. I am now getting mad. Which is gonna be bad for me, it seems like. Because that's the only person that's suffering at this ridiculous result. Yes, okay. Whew, okay, I feel awesome now. We got those done up. So that's great. That's good stuff. Okay, now, what I'm going to try to do this time is I'm going to roll this along and then just let go. There we go. You see? That works. Yeah, it's a good strategy. Okay, now... Same thing. Roll it, roll it, roll it, rolling. Oh my god, are you kidding me? You ruined it, Robin. You ruined it yourself. Oh, great. That's just, that's just fantastic. I mean, that is exactly what I wanted. No, no! <laughs> this is unbelievable! Okay, nope. Yes! Fantastic! Yay! I'm so happy! I can't even believe that that actually worked this time. Okay, so we've got only those left right there. And then after that, we're done, thankfully. God is nice to me today, I guess. He's kind, for he forgives me for failing so many times. Oh, careful! Nope. Nope, 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 nope! Okay, let's grab... Let's grab this one, shall we? I think we should be able to get this. We should be able to, but... Again. Okay, there's one. I don't know why I lost control of that ball there. Alrighty, there's two, and come on, just fall into that little hole, yes, okay, terrific, fantastic, now, where's your swimsuit, yay, there we go, okay, get out of the water, and go pull that lever, because we're almost done, finally, <laughs> oh, how glad am I to say that, you don't even know, okay, the lever doesn't want to bring us back, there we go, finally. And there's our last stud. Yay! All studs collected! Awesome! And of course, right now you get a um, achievement. Two achievements, actually. 
Um, but you can't see them because I turned off notifications, so that's why. Level complete! Boom, boom, ba -da -boom, ba -da -boom, ba -da boom, ba -da boom, New best time, 22 minutes and 54 seconds and 28 milliseconds. That's how, that's how extreme that stuff gets. But that being said, if you guys enjoyed this extra episode, of course, tune in to the next episode, which should be going up uh, two days from today. That's going to be, of course, the villains episode, so that should be pretty gosh darn fun as well. So tune in for that. Uh, hopefully, there's going to be a lot less failing during that one. But that being said, if you guys enjoyed the Wayne Manor bonus episode for, of course, LEGO Batman, give the video a like. It really does help me out a ton. On top of that, if you could please share the video with your family and friends and favorite the video, that would be highly, highly appreciated as well. Tune in to the next episode. I'll catch you guys next time. Have a fan fantastic day, and I'll see ya later. Thanks for watching, guys and girls and aliens and whoever is still listening to me talking. Peace.